on what we can expect on Wednesday. Well, it's not going to be as mild as it was yesterday afternoon, Patrick. Uh, temperatures back to more seasonable highs, but the winds will make it even feel colder. Let's start off on live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. The rain that we were picking up yesterday, leading to a lot of street and localized uh, flooding, has come to an end. We are still tracking a few snow showers off to our north and west. Some of those have already tried to pass through. We'll keep an eye on this little batch here that's over Hartford and Springfield suburbs. That uh, too may try to move move eastward here over the next couple of hours. The other thing we're watching will be the temperatures. They may fall close to the freezing mark, which could lead to a little bit of patchy black ice. So we're into a more seasonable stretch. Temperatures rest of this work week will feature average highs for late February. And they also are going to feature some gusty winds and we're growing more confident about this coastal storm this weekend. For our area, it looks like a messy mix. Doesn't mean that we're not going to get some accumulations out of it, but I also think we'll see some rain and sleet mix seen in temperatures. Well, they are in the 30s right now, still above freezing everywhere. It's 37 Providence, 34 in Coventry, about 36 in Westerly and Newport coming in at about 37. Dry, cool for the commute this morning, about 30 to 35. So obviously I'm envisioning those temperatures falling even further here in the next few hours and they'll have a tough time recovering this afternoon. Here's the future cast showing a clear start. Notice a couple of snow showers or flurries try to pass through around the afternoon hours by the time the commute home from work gets underway. We're back to uh, dry skies and then it should clear out overnight, which will lead to a much colder night for us back into the teens for late night lows when you wake up Thursday morning for your afternoon high today about 36 in Newport 35 in Charlestown Coventry near 35 northern part of the state gusty winds chilly mix of sun and clouds about the mid 30s during the afternoon hours Foster Johnston about 35 Cumberland and Woonsocket running near 34 and the temperatures in southeastern mass under times of sun and clouds in mid 30s I have Fall River and New Bedford around 36 Seekonk at 35 and again that potential for a flurry or a snow shower seven day future cast. Uh, so we have that snow shower for today around 35 down to 18 tonight. I think Friday may end up the pick of the week highs near 40 with sunshine. We are still looking at that coastal storm developing. It does look likely at this point. The track right now would support a mix of rain, snow and sleet, and it should arrive by late in the day on Saturday. As we head into Sunday, colder air will wrap back in on the backside of the storm, and it's during this time on Sunday that I think we'd have the best potential of getting some accumulation snow with maybe heavy wet snow combined with strong wind. So that's something that we're going to have to watch for, uh, especially later Saturday night into Sunday. Monday's high sunny skies near 41 and we could be looking at rain or mix by the end of the day on Tuesday. So we are still in a very active weather pattern where every few days 